Hello everyone, do you have a Bring it to you in a episode on Middle Earth, Shadow of Mortal. Where we last left it off, we embarked with Torvin in some beast hunting uh, trials in order to test our might to take on a mighty Grog that Torgold knows and uh, sadly apparently also took in his hunting partner. We passed the hunting trials with flying colors and we are nerdy to take it on. But the man has to basically wait for the time being. Because right now, we need enough gonna see what the old hag has to offer on how to nearly enough bask ourselves in making our orc army. So without further ado, let's near enough begin. The power of the reef. Queen Marin holds the key to unlocking the true power of the ring maker the power to command and dominate forge an army to challenge the black captain ew lady marwin she's going black oh you okay? Why have you returned? You are not done yet. How did you know where to find this? He has shown me. You haven't told me what you want in return. Only that you learn what you are truly capable of. Find an orc leader, make him a war chief, and all his soldiers will be yours. Where am I to lead this? Army of mine. Bring them to me, and I will show you. Okay, drop it on the floor, I don't, yeah? Could just talk with you. She could uh, she could trip on that and fall, and she ended up dead. We're fucked. Marwin said to bring her an army. We shall not build an army. We shall command one. We'll need to find an Uruk captain to dominate and make our own. There is a slaver near here named Grublik. We will make him serve our cause. I don't know how basically you know that, but... Okay. Now, like I said before, when it comes to dominating orcs, this is where the only enough the fun part comes in. For me, in general. But, uh, yes. We now got near enough. Go after Grublik. And apparently make a mine. Have him serve the right army. So uh, let us make our way there. We should find him. Groovy. Bingo! Oh, now unlocked the ability to now dominate all captains. Which is good. So, what I'm first gonna do is uh, I'm gonna need some eyes in the sky. I'm gonna need some aerial support. Hey. Serve me. Join me! And everyone else, attack! Dead man! Time to die slow, as slow as a day is long. I wouldn't say that. No! Get off me. Get off. Get off. Now go basically take care of uh, our captain here, and I'm gonna have to blow this out. No way, I don't! Huzzah! I am saved! Get off. Let's take care of him. Nice. You lose. Hey, can you take care of the captain, please? Thank you. Oh, bro, you killed him. We needed him. God damn it, Orc! Picked this man way too well. I didn't expect him to die though, so yeah. I was very black. God damn it. I did these orcs too well. We can't pick another red bag. This Uruk must be a true leader. Got you now. Now you serve me! Yes! Now we have the first to command him. 
And now we've got to make him go after Zazu the knife. Off you go. Good job, lads. It is Even though you really all didn't do much. We must now make this captain a bodyguard if he is ever to be a war chief. It is from first strike of thunder that is soon born a storm. Now, here's where basically the tedious bit comes in when it comes to having your own dominant orcs, well, become now war chiefs because uh, they're now going to prove their might. And I'm going to be practically honest, it's more or less pretty much easy or hard depending on what it has to be. So, as you can basically see here. Join me or face the end of my sword, maggots! Go away! I serve another! It was that. Eliminate all those who challenge him. Oh, get up. Okay. Now let's, uh. Berserk kill. Making the group fear and Kawa. You serve me. And there we go. There's the first lot done. Now, in order to like, kind of like make this way more easier, you can just take out all of the orcs. Okay, who's gonna run away and who's gonna stay and fight? Oh, none of yours. Oh, how how much for change? Yeah, where's the next slot? They're all dead. Yeah, there's the third lot, so let's take care of that real quick. Well, actually, we're the ones doing more of the work here, if I'm being honest. And let's preserve Kelly's lot. Okay, who's gonna stand for I? Oh, you're a worm. I need you. Join me. Now, worms are very important because they can give you more wisdom on your captain that you want to dominate. And off camera, I have been, well, dominating a lot of worms for this special occasion because who knows? One might be very, very important. I don't know what to say. You can go now. You give me uh, plenty to look for. Okay. Job done for you, Captain. I conquered the weak. Now join me in victory. Any who oppose me will pay with their blood to red swords. Yeah. Red swords. Now that we yep. have our hunter, let us stalk our prey. Recruitment did well, he got a power increase, and he's been promoted to bodyguard. Reached the vantage point without raising the alarm. The war chief has chosen our captain, and he has chosen death. A greater vantage will ready us for this battle. <laughs> Indeed, so now let us make our way there. Welcome to the right army, good sir. We might need you for a quote escape. Listen to them. Vile savage beasts. I didn't quite catch any of that what he said, I was too emerged there. My apologies. Oh crap. Eat up. Get here. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. Get up here. I'm surprised that these lot don't even see us, because again, like, it would probably take a professional to kind of see, hey, there's someone here. Exact retribution by turning that evil against itself. The queen is right. 
We are wise to use the Ulrich's ruthlessness against them. Well, I guess that's one way of getting revenge. In a sense, turning something you hate most against itself. Okay, get up here. And now, our watchy friend has arrived. Along with another bodyguard though, so we kind of got to take care of that bodyguard, or... Crip that. Okay, look, before we do anything like that, let me see our uh, petition. Okay, he's not bad. What's he... Oh, he can be injured by explosions. Okay. And now our orc friend will now attack the war chief. The alarm raised. Ah, uh, we'll set up this. And release the categories. And now let's help our war chief before he ends up dead. Oh, you're on my side. That's nice. Hey, join me. Join the right army, sir. Oh, for fuck's sake, let me jump. Get him. Hey, he's fine. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. Give me intel real quick before, you know, we, we go to war here. Uh, give me intel on this guy. Uh, no, he's shit. Okay, you can go. Thank you. We're going to have orc dominated. Okay, where do we get now? Okay, take care of you. Ways to cut you down. Allow me to show you a few. Just met, man. If we're gonna do it, man, like I would like to get to know you first before you know, if we go down that path. Oh shit. Hey. Nope. Hey, Orcs, do your work here. What do I pay you? Shit, okay. Shit! Shit! Oh, you shit! So you can reach attacks. Get off me! Get off me! Dodge! Or a captain, please do something! Again, what am I paying you for? Oh, now I'm stuck. Get his ass. Get off me. Get off me. He's almost dead, he's almost dead, he's almost dead. Get off me. There we yonder. The knives has been defeated. Now my dude has been promoted to War Chief and he's got himself some new friends. I fight for the Dark Lord, and you shall fight for me. This is my dominion. I am the strongest War Chief in all of Mordor. I shall lead my army over a field of broken skulls. Come stand behind me, or let my blade meet your neck. Well, you don't really have a blade, as well as a club. Strength should not be squandered, but wielded. The Queen will show us how. Marwyn's strategy yields great results. An army of our own to face darkness head on. A mirror looking upon itself, ready to be cracked. We should return to Marwyn. She will have more for us. Yes. Wow, and we, we did sit. It was a pain to get, but we did sit. Oh, yeah, why do you will for the Shanker, man? So, who is it? Who is it that she's trying to take? I don't get it. So you guys wanted to portray the Black Lord anyway? Oh, 
shit. Is she dead? Oh no, she lives. Are you alright? And everything's back to normal. Oh, and she looks even now younger. I am. Yo, beauty care in a nutshell. I am now that I can finally see you. Oh, not tea. My child. Your mother. He's been under the spell of a very powerful wizard. Italian. I am sorry. Saruman brought you here against my will. I went to him for help. I ended up being a prisoner within my own body. What have you seen in your visions? I have seen Sauron's servants. The tower. And the black hand. They bring much suffering. If you wish to know where they are, they are across the Sea of Nanan. Their forces. How strong? Strong enough to defeat us all. E. Then we truly will need an army. A rat army. Illness still plagues you. Rest, mother. I will make preparations for our journey out of Mordor. And there we Saruman go. Saruman is one of the Istari. With the power of the ring, he could have built a great army to challenge the Dark Lord. And that's what we must do. The one garrison does not an army make. Yes. We must dominate more war chiefs for a true army. So there we go. We've now got to be now branding war chiefs for, well, our final fight. To make our way over there. But, uh... For the time being, um, oh now what's this quest? The cure of the great white crow. Hmm. Now let me think on what I should do next. I've decided, uh, we're gonna do the great white crow. So let's make our way there. And I will be RB. Thank you, Mr. Category, sir. So let's take on now the great white crow. Torvin is ready to face his past. Torvin! We're to take down the orc. I mean, Graug. Heads up, Captain! <laughs> Time to go hunting! <laughs> oh, great, you got me a category. Oh, nice. Fucking hell. Okay, I'm ready. Charge him more. Okay, I'm gonna probably die by a category. Do this the old-fashioned way. Get oh fucking hell. Who knew that my hardest thing right now would be would be to tame a fucking well dominate a Graug. Oh, fucking hell, come down! I'm gonna die by a fucking category. Fuck off, Torvin. <laughs> I didn't train well for this. Move away from the category. Got you this time. You weren't leaving me. Get your way, see what. Get your way, see I assume you know the path. The real question is, are you ready to travel it? Uh, on how I tamed this orc, then no. Actually, that's a good life lesson for you to follow always. I pray your training sticks, or else you'll stick to the wall once the mighty Graug holds you there. I'm ready to fight the Graug. Talion, you're not. I'm not. No art, no finesse. The hunt isn't about swinging and slashing, it's bigger than that. From your perspective, Dwarf, everything is bigger. Yes, this crowd is very, very big. 
Okay, how did you get out alive? Luck. The growl knocked me senseless. When I came to, it had ended my partner. Facing that creature alone was a death sentence. I'd been hunting this growl for almost a decade. That's a lot of years of dedication to one beast. Dedication? Or a sign you preach better than you hunt? Oh, that's funny, Captain. Probably sure to laugh when the beast eats you alive. The mighty yeah. Grau will be my legacy. Dwarves will tell tales of Torben the Hunter for generations. And I'll have them throw your name in there somewhere. You're too kind. Torben, you really are. Whoa! The Karagors are too quiet. I don't think the Grau is home. <laughs> But only one way to find we out. We gans Ouch. in there. How military. I like it. <sighs> We's here. And the dude's got his axe. And I got my sword. Now you're old. That's just as sharp as a day our father made it. <laughs> they said it must be your hunting partners. And I guess we found the hammer, so we're getting another flashback scene. Probably the last. <laughs> yep, we're getting another flashback scene. Gently pressing. Something shiny on him. Is that the one ring? So wait, was he dominated and was forced to make the ring? No. Hey, that's right. Remember me. He's back. <laughs> and man's got flashing in. I was passed out. I'm sorry. Oh, I got jumps. Surprised on how we didn't get my ass. Here we go! Boss time! The legendary Graug. Yeah, just do what we're told them to. Move away from the Graug and get him to charge. Yes, will do. I am running for my life. You cannot get me. Shoot the skull disorient him. Shoot the shoot a charged Grog in the head to disorientize him and then dodge. Okay. Oh, I have a chance, I have a chance. I won. Attack! Get his ass! 
Beat his ass. And we took out a big chunk. Look at these. Ghouls? Get off. Stop the ghouls. Oh, why? Shoot the ghouls. Interrupt them. Wait. Oh, he's gaining health. Yeah. You. You. No. Shoot that one. Dodge. Dodge and weave. We can dodge. You. Dude, stop hitting me poison. Okay. No back to it. Feet legendary ground. Charge up, mate. Come on, hit me. Hit me. Hit me. He's charging. Out the way. Okay, that was a long ass jump. Now let's attack him. Against. And take another big chunk of health off him. He's almost dead. Now go stop the ghouls again. No dinner! No dinner for you, Mr. Grog! No dinner! No dinner! No dinner! No dinner! No dinner! Oh, there's a ton of them on him. Hey, get off him! Motherfucker! Oh, I'm trying to... Save you guys from eat, being eaten. It's best to be slashed by a sword than to be eaten. Get off of me. Get off of me. Okay, there we go. And now let's get the fuck out the way. Okay, hit me. Hit me. It got you. Let's touch up the way. And it should be GG. Attack again. And there we go. That was pretty easy for a massive growl. That Tolvin had to basically take care of. Oh. Get hell, Tolvin. It's down. It's down. I think he's dead. <laughs> ah, ah, well, that's what I call beast hunting, eh? Indeed, indeed. Next time, I'm not gonna let you have all the fun. Oh, no, no. This is the last time. I have other prey to pursue. Well, you need help on your journey, so what do you say? We put no, some no, chance. No, 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 I have to do this on my own. Yeah, so's mine. You'll probably get hurt, and I don't want you to die, man. You're a good if friend. You survive. <clears throat> Come to the Blue Mountains, eh? <laughs> and lots of friends that will drink until their kegs run dry. I've seen how much a dwarf can drink. <laughs> I do hope our paths cross again. Wait. Now, how do I get you out of here? <laughs> Oh, got my catagol. That's nice. And there we go. The Great White Grog successfully done. I hope that Torvin finds his way home now that his hunt is over. If he does, then he will find his home is not as he left it. Oh, yeah, because in it, uh, there's not very much dwarves. But yeah, that is about it. I think the, the one thing about this mission regarding Tolvik and Talion's companion. You get to know a lot more about Tolvin than you do about Talion's companion. I can basically agree on that. But, uh, I am going to sadly end uh, things off here. I do apologize in advance if this video was a bit short or a bit boring, uh, as usual. And again, I do apologize on that. But, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like. If you didn't, then uh, don't. I don't give a rat's ass. 
But for question of the day, who do you think was more or less enjoyable? Um, Talion's companion or Torvin? And that. That's my question of the day. Who do, who do you find is more, like, who do you would probably like more? Torvin or Talion's companion? Let me know in the comments below on that. But if you are interested in joining the Rat Kingdom in any way, shape, or form, then a link to our Discord server is in the description below. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed. And as always, peace. DX is out.